I have been waiting for this day since I proposed to you seemingly an eternity ago. In our five years together, we have gone through what some couples have experienced in a lifetime, even a freaking pandemic. I believe that this has only made us stronger as a whole. From our first day until now, you have pushed me, challenged me, motivated me to become uh, the man that I am today. I am so unimaginably head over heels in love with you. I didn't want to let you love in, show you all my scars. I was scared that you would scare you. Now here we are. When I first came to know Ellen and Chris, they were about to be engaged. The fact that they were both in love was immediately apparent. That they were best friends was something I slowly learned to both recognize and admire, and then, later, hope to emulate. It's really been kind of a rough year and a half. Um, I know Chris and Ellen are doing their part in keeping everyone's spirits up by having a wedding every few months, so... <laughs> um, that's been good in helping us with this challenge. Now everyone who knows our family knows I can't say enough good things about Chris. Uh, I don't think anybody could deny what a stand-up guy he is after the way he stepped in and was there, not only for our mom and for Ellen, but for my dad and Kate and for me. Um, I'm just so happy, Ellen, that you can spend the rest of your life knowing that mom not only loved your husband, but she almost definitely loved your husband more than she loved all of us. <laughs> figuring out long distance, to dealing with every obstacle that could come our way. There is no one that I'd rather have by my side. And I can't wait to start this journey with you. Chris, you really couldn't have picked a better girl. Again, I know I'm biased, um, but our Ellen is strong, fiercely opinionated. <laughs> but most importantly, she has a huge and caring heart it's the little things like these, though, that make marriage so much fun. Because yes, adulting is difficult, and this world can be unpleasant. But at the end of the day, when you two are in bed and you look at each other, at least you can both smile knowing you have each other to take on anything as a team. By the power invested in me, by the Universal Life Church in the state of Pennsylvania, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride.